All right, everybody. Um, first kit review for uh, 2016 is the from the classic TV series Lost in Space, 50th anniversary, 124th scale chariot. Always wanted this kit. I finally got it, and I'm going to do a kit review here in a minute. Um, I know Mobius does a good job with detail. Uh, there's nothing on the back. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, open this up and do a kit review on it here in a minute. Um, this one vehicle I always liked was the Chariot, like the Space Pod, and uh, which I already have that built. I think it's the same scale. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, put this on my uh, table behind me and do a kit review on it and open it up and give everybody a look at it. And I'll get back with everybody here in a minute. Alright everybody, back on the chariot. I figured I'd give everybody a closer look at it before I open it up. Artwork on the uh, front here looks really cool. The chariot down here, you got a little sticker on it. 50th anniversary from 1965 to 2015. It's pretty cool. Uh, on the side here it shows it's uh, skill level 3. 124th scale. And from uh, Mobius. I'm going to go ahead and open this up here uh, here in a minute and we we'll get take a look on the inside and see how detailed the chariot is. So hang tight, I'll get back here in a minute. All right, everybody, got the box open and um, take a look at the parts. I can see why it's a skill level three. There's a lot of parts here. One thing I've noticed is it's got some guns right here. They're laser rifles. I don't know if that's going to come in focus too good but there's a pair of them uh, they look pretty cool uh, on the other side here you got the seats they're decent scale a lot of parts in here uh, next one down is the clear parts there's the dome right here Really nicely detailed. More parts here. Wow. Kind of a little robot right there. That's really cool. Nicely detailed. Uh, I don't know. I think this kit, it looks like it comes with the full robot. I think you might have an option where you could put it on the inside, if I'm not mistaken. But here it looks like he's a, um, a full robot. That's going to be cool. This looks like it's the bottom of the chariot. I'm going to have to take these parts out of the plastic so everybody can get a better look. Here's the tread and the tires. They said I guess they upgraded these treads from the previous kit. Here's the upper part of the chariot. Looks pretty cool. Detailed. I'll have to take that out of the bag as well. Got these metal rods, they're probably for the track. That's pretty cool. And then the instructions, so let's go take a look at the instructions. The artwork looks pretty cool. Okay, assembly, assembly instructions for the Lost in Space Chariot. Looks like a thousand parts right there. A lot of parts right there. Robot. And uh, the axle right here. P 
pictures of uh, the chariot that looks pretty cool rear side open it up here shows how to assemble the uh, tracks that's pretty cool other picture of the inside of the chariot down here as well and then here is shown how to maybe uh, do the framework windows or like let's see the doors these are the doors then the robot that's pretty cool And it's got uh, paint colors for the chariot, suggested paint colors, flat aluminum, bright silver, metallic gray, another gray metallic red, yellow, blue, gunmetal, green, gloss aluminum, international orange, gloss white, wood, dark gray, gloss black, flat black, steel, and transparent red. Wow. But I have this built already, and like I said, I think it's the same scale, 1 24th scale. So I'm going to go ahead and call this a, a, a part of the kit review. I want to open up the, the bags and take a look at the parts themselves. So everybody hang tight, and I'll be back in a minute. All right, everybody, back on the chariot. Let's take a closer look at the parts, the top of the chariot clear part is really cool a lot of detail decent size for 124th scale really nice sturdy plastic nice and clear really cool part here I'm sure I think it probably goes on top of the chariot that's pretty cool little part of the robot right here front top looks pretty cool more parts there's the bottom of the robot There's a uh, back side of the robot and the bottom part right here. So I uh, take it he's full scale for 124th scale. There's the radar dish. That's pretty cool. I think that's the solar panel right there. A lot of uh, parts to this kit. A lot of detail. There's a control panel. That looks pretty cool. Uh, oops, I think it goes this way. Shouldn't have a problem lightening, lighting this kit up. Some fiber optics. There's the metal console there. That's pretty cool. Light that up. You know there's aftermarket parts for this. I have to check into it see what I can do and maybe get maybe some aftermarket parts here's the other parts to the kit the laser rifles I was telling you about closer look you get two of them that's pretty cool a lot of parts here I can see already it's going to take me a while to build this kit. More parts here. More 
parts down here the seats more seats so I'm going to go ahead and call this a wrap on the kit review for the 124th scale chariot figured I'd share this with everybody I'll be building this down the road I'd like to thank all my YouTube subscribers and everybody have a good day